uh, okay, it's, for somehow this is take three. Now, I have to do the intro over again. <coughs> I'm glad uh, I, what happened when I was using the camera plugs to show you this old antique easter egg. Now everybody knows this can. In the 70s, for a while they had look for a joke inside and you look in there. Now this is an old fancy can. It doesn't have a joke. Okay? During the 70s, between 72 to 70. Eight nine, they had a little something look. Now they went through a, a few tops. Now, if you recently I found a a newer one with this. When you see this top, and this is why right after they remove look in the can for a joke. You open it up with a can open. I know I have to just saw it, but and in the bottom, oh, this is an old one. You get a joke. This is not a numbered series or an alphabet series. This is pre. Because this was two set. One to twenty-six, eight to Z. This is a not a, this is before they added French on top on, on the bottom and English for the joke. This is from the series. And the joke is what's always worth something in an eye. That's what near. Just because, see, I had a, I collect these. In the 70s, other on bottle caps, there was can contest. Now, this is the first one I have found in 30 years with a joke in it. An old joke. Now, you could tell by the top, they was, um, say, do not let on here. It's the old pre-1970 can, 72 can. This is when they bought lemon. Now, as you know, both of them have lead on it. Both of them made by Coca-Cola. This is what a today can look like. One piece of lemon. Back my day, it's tin lead and a piece of plastic that piece of plastic was saved with the you know pop all the time the pop would eat the plastic and you get the lead in stuff but since people have forgotten this easter egg because it was a, not a brief time, but a few years, and also on pen to pop, onto the cap, there was jokes. It was a nice time drinking your favorite cream soda. This is when cream soda was cream soda, and orange was orange. Now, I found uh, a couple houses have been knocked down, and Finally, I found this in the, in the corner, and it's a bit faded, dented. And these days, when I can get dent, they get dent. Not like in these the old days, you have to put your foot to actually crush these things. Other than your little pop there, it's so easy to crush. These you need a month of. Now back to the hidden age. To anyone who collect old can pop cans, I have two so far. It's very hard to find these in the north with hardly any rust. 
And yes, this is one of the real hobbies I had when I was a kid because it was a good party breaker in school. Yeah, I had one where you could have a pop in school before the burn it because of the sugar in it. So, this is probably a 1970, for early 75 version. Now, this I know I have done the can just to show it because back then you have to look through here, get the light just correctly in there to read the joke. When it was small with French and English, it was even harder. Imagine opening it and you try to. But there is another thing. In the series, the tabs had contested pieces. And I know recently the pole tabs here and the monster have little codes here to win things. But that's nothing new. To find a tab with the contest that you won or you miss. That's in the series. That's when they first started these ones. And to win something, you pull the tab and you look at the tab. Then they came up with the idea you look inside for a joke, a contest piece, and then you get your can opener and open it just like a wiggle can. You notice and this is like a wiggle can. I could open both of them. When my take one, what happened? Somehow I froze the video when this went flying because it was. I think about 30 years or, or more than I opened one of these with the old fashioned can. This is how people in the old days clocked these, like they with A, B, C, and clock to win the phase. This is part of a hidden childhood. Now, this is not a video game issue. This is a history collecting his because this was only available in Canada. This. United States didn't, Pension for the United States didn't have it. It's this is a, it's only available in Canada before they put look inside the can below the sign. So this is pre 1975. It didn't wait, wait in, the, in this old yard for that long onto pieces of wood. Now, I'm kind of happy that this has happened. Everything, because these contest cans are so hard. You have to get to a night. I don't that dated back in the 70s around here. And they are hard because we are slowly cleaning. See, here in White House, our border, the city border, is 10 miles all around me. And they've been for years cleaning up these old dumps. Every time an old house been knocked down by they have been going in the yard and finding old things. Because, you know, so anybody who have old fence cans, who clack old fence cans, look inside, you may be present for an Easter egg with the old joke in it. There you go. It's something that not many people remember. Now, I'm still going to keep the can because this type of top is hard to find. And there you go. This has been a special Easter egg and I hope most of the people who do clack old cans look inside, especially in Canada, to see um, the old Superman 7-Up um, contest. You look in those, you see Superman doing things. And what, what that contest is, you clack Superman, and you win three pop with that one. At the time, you will have a star in the world in Superman, the original movie. So in that movie, there's a kid who won the contest. I'm not telling you which kid, 
that won the Superman contest from looking underneath and cracking all the images of Saint of Superman. That's a part of a pop can history that hardly nobody knows. As for the people who like me who have a hobby like this. Bye now bye for now.